Every week, football fans across the world watch and cheer for their favorite teams. As players strive to make an impression on the field, they begin to get recognized for their dedication. Fans are frequently quick to evaluate whether they like a player or not, and major famous stars usually have a large fan base. What distinguishes a good player is their ability to thrive in their position and consistently offer their team with strong performances that help them win matches. Footballers such as Lionel Messi, Cristiano Ronaldo and Neymar are all highly regarded by fans worldwide. However, there are those that don't get the acknowledgement they deserve. We take a look at six of the most underrated footballers. 6. Michael Carrick, Manchester United After joining Man United from Spurs in 2006, Carrick made his name as being one of the most reliable deep-lying midfielders in the Premier League. The 40-year-old is one of the most decorated players in Premier League history, having played a key role in United's victories of the 2008 Champions League, five Premier League crowns, one FA Cup, and two League Cups. Carrick, a leader on and off the field who later served as the club's coach, will always be remembered as one of United's best midfielders. When you think about the important players for the Red Devils, you look at all the trophies he won, and he was a key member of the squad at that time. However, Carrick never received the recognition he deserved. Carrick only made 34 appearances for England, despite having a successful club career, because he found it difficult to establish himself in a team that was dominated by players like Frank Lampard and Steven Gerrard. He wasn't only someone who would clean up in front of the back four for England, he was also one of the finest midfield's passes. He was so underutilized by England. The way he could play the ball through the lines or in behind, he wasn't afraid to try things. He was one of the best of his time in his position, and if people have a proper think about it, they'll see that he was competing with amazing world-class players like Lampard and Gerrard at the time. He deserves to be in that bracket too. Juan Mata once said that he would have been appreciated more in Spain than he was in England. 5. Jorginho Wijnaldum, Liverpool Wijnaldum, another hard-working midfielder, shown throughout his time at Liverpool that he was worth far more than the £27 million transfer fees the club spent for him. The 31-year-old was a crucial part of Jurgen Klopp's 2019 league-winning team, which helped the club break their prolonged titles drought. Although players like Sadio Mane, Salah and Firmino received the most of the attention, Wijnaldum was the heart of the Liverpool midfield, and he went unnoticed for his contributions to those performances. Wijnaldum is the engine inside a dominant Liverpool midfield. He is a great all-rounded player that can score, create chances and be disciplined in defence. His style of play makes him hidden sometimes in the Liverpool setup. Nevertheless, his contributions to their performances are vital to ensure they get chances, leaving him as one of the most underrated players. 4. Sergio Busquets, FC Barcelona Playing in a team of superstars can sometimes make it hard for players like Busquets to get noticed. Surrounded by the likes of Xavi, Iniesta, Messi, Neymar and Fabregas during his career, the Spaniard has held his own and continues to put on exemplary performances from midfield. While he is most renowned for his defensive qualities in the middle of the field, Busquets' skills as an outstanding passer sometimes go unrecognized, which is why he has been included on our list of underappreciated footballing players. Sergio Busquets transformed the defensive midfielder's role. He has played alongside some of the world's greatest as a faithful servant of Barcelona. Busquets has spent 12 years with the Spanish Giants, winning every trophy imaginable, including three Champions Leagues and eight league crowns. He has also made 119 appearances for Spain's national team, winning both the World Cup and the Euros. Busquets' defensive awareness makes him very hard to beat in the middle of the park. His composure on the ball prevents him losing possession, and he has the ability and vision to pick out passes to create attacks. Sergio Busquets is definitely one of the most underrated players of all time. 3. Andrea Perlo, Juventus Andrea Perlo retired from professional football in 2017 after a long career in Italy. As an incredible playmaker, it is about time Perlo was recognized for how good he was. His range of passing was phenomenal, 
his skills graceful, and his free kicks exceptional. Andrea Perlo is widely regarded as one of the best midfielders of his generation, but he is also one of the most underrated football players of all time. Despite his extraordinary abilities and accomplishments, Pirlo never earned the same amount of attention and acclaim as some of his contemporaries. Pirlo must have wondered what it would take to be featured in the hackneyed rants of these purported experts, while Spanish midfielders Xavi and Iniesta were hailed significantly more during his heyday. Pirlo put Italy on the map at a period when England and Spain were dominating. His ability to manage and regulate the rate of play was unrivaled. He was an expert at long-range passing, frequently setting up his teammates with perfect accuracy. His vision and technical ability allowed him to consistently create scoring opportunities for his team. Yet his contribution was often overlooked in favor of more flashy players. Perlo's game intelligence was second to none, and his ability to read the game and anticipate the opposition's moves were critical to his team's success. Perlo's international success is sometimes ignored. He was instrumental in Italy's World Cup victory in 2006, netting a decisive penalty in the final against France. He also helped Italy reach the Euro 2012 final when they were defeated by Spain. Pirlo was named the man of the match in Italy's opening game against Spain, demonstrating his importance to the team's victory. He was a significant figure in Juventus's early 2010 dominance of Italian football, although his performances were sometimes underappreciated in favor of the team's renowned attackers. His modest temperament and lack of flamboyant play, on the other hand, frequently led to his being overlooked by fans and critics alike. In my opinion, Perlo deserves to be more praise than he got. 2. Olivier Giroud, Arsenal Olivier Giroud is remembered graciously for his adventurous goals, especially the Puskas winning strike against Crystal Palace in 2017. The Frenchman played for Arsenal and Chelsea and had a brilliant career in England. Giroud joined Arsenal in 2012 after helping Montpellier to the League One title. The striker quickly became Arsene Wenger's first choice striker at the Emirates. Giroud was barely the most lethal finisher, to be honest, but he was always able to lure his teammates into the game and score goals when needed. In 255 Premier League games for Arsenal and Chelsea, Giroud had 90 goals and 32 assists. He has more Premier League goals than, to mention a few, Bergkamp, Tevez, Torres, and Eden Hazard. And he has more Premier League assists than Suarez, Bale, and Zaha, as well as a higher goal per minute ratio for France's Henry, Griezmann, and Benzema. This man is the most underrated player of his generation. During his career in England, Giroud never won a league title. He did, however, win the FA Cup four times, the Community Shield three times, the UEFA Champions League, and the Europa League. He is presently an AC Milan striker and France's all-time second-highest goal scorer. Olivier Giroud is one of those attackers who has produced remarkable performances but has struggled to maintain a starting spot on a regular basis. Giroud deserves more recognition than he has gotten. 1. Thomas Muller, Bayern Munich Muller has been greatly overlooked given that his influence at domestic, in Europe and internationally isn't frequently emphasized. The extent to which he influences his team is sometimes overlooked. The main quality that distinguishes Muller is his adaptability. Regardless of the opposition, he regularly turns in noteworthy performances, helping his side out with goals and assists. He is a vital asset to Bayern Munich because of his ability to adapt to different roles and places on the field. Thomas Muller is considered as one of the finest players of his time, and his outstanding career statistics say eloquently of his remarkable ability. With a remarkable total of 754 appearances, Mueller has consistently delivered outstanding performances on the field, amassing an impressive record of 277 goals and 261 assists across various competitions. Representing Germany, Mueller has enjoyed success at the highest level. He played a vital role in Germany's FIFA World Cup victory in 2014 and contributed to their third place finish in 2010. His individual accolades include the FIFA World Cup Golden Boot in 2010. Muller has experienced tremendous success in the Bundesliga, winning an astonishing 12 league titles with Bayern Munich. 
His consistency and vital contributions have played a pivotal role in the team's dominance over the years. His career statistics and achievements paint a clear picture of his extraordinary abilities and contributions to the sport. With his impressive goal-scoring record, remarkable number of assists, versatility, consistency, and a long list of honors, Muller has rightfully earned his place among the very best players of his generation. However, he will never be mentioned in the same breath as Messi, Ronaldo, Neymar, or Lewandowski. It is for this reason. Thomas Muller will be the most underrated player of this generation. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and click the notifications bell for more video. Until the next one, stay tuned.